Well, welcome to the Pacific Green Party meeting uh, on January 30th at uh, the Cascadia Chapter at Bipartisan Cafe. And our Honorable Speaker Michael Mayo has a statement tonight for us. I'm going to sit out of the way here and enjoy my homemade pie and coffee and I'll let Michael go ahead and speak. Good evening, those of you watching this recording. This week, we had the President of the United States fulfill his constitutional duty of making a report on the State of the Union to the Congress and to the Supreme Court in public. What is the State of the Union presently? It is a union that has been more or less at war constantly since Truman decided to respond to the North Korean invasion of South Korea in 1950. We have been at war for 60 years at least. And during this time that we have been at war, we have not asked the Congress once to declare war against any boss. How about our present president? What has he done with this war? Well, he got out of Iraq. He ran for office. You will remember saying that Iraq was the wrong war at the wrong time. But he's not opposed to war. He escalated the war in Afghanistan. And he increased the amount of use of unmanned drones by a factor of at least 10, and maybe 15 or 20, over George Bush, who we all hate, of course, because we're leftists. Our, our Democratic president has escalated the war in Afghanistan and has, by an order of magnitude, increased the number of times and the extent of the use of drones, not only in Pakistan, but also in Yemen and many other countries. They have been subjected to bombing by United States Armed Forces with no declaration of war. Why has this happened? This has happened because when you engage in war, you import the same brutality, the same disregard for the other person's rights and, and privileges to the home country. The home country becomes brutalized. The home country becomes tyrannized. The home country becomes a, 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 a subjected to the uh, footprints, the bloody footprints of the warmongers, among which leading the charge is the Democratic Party of the United States. If we are ever to get out of this position of a constant war that is degrading all of our rights in this country and that is reducing us to poverty, we will not get it by voting for Democrats, that's for sure. That's the State of the Union from the Green perspective as of January of 2013, 2014. Thank you and good night.